When you choose one of these four photos, I will give you the message and prediction that you were meant to hear today. These messages and predictions have an extremely high accuracy rate and you will likely be shocked by the results as you'll see in just a few minutes. And to make this video even more fun and interesting, be on the lookout for woodland creatures behind me. I'm telling you that since I've started filming, I've literally seen birds, I saw a cat, I've seen butterflies. There is a lot of activity going on behind me. And I think because it's about to rain and there's like extra dirt in the yard as you see. But keep an eye out for some fun little creatures playing around today. These choose a photo videos are some of my most requested videos here on my channel. So if you like these types of videos, be sure to quickly hit that little thumbs up button below so that I know to keep making more for you. My goal is to do at least once a month, but let me know if you want more frequent. So in this video, I will be sharing not only your message, not only your prediction, but also an exact affirmation and a meditation to start using and a symbol based on whichever photo you chose. So you are going to get so many tools that not only help you make sense of this message, but also things to act on. Now let's get right into the details. If you've been here before, you know the drill, but just in case you're new here, how it works is I'm about to put four photo cards up on the screen, and then I will give you an accurate prediction and manifestation message that you need to hear based on whichever photo you chose. And also, if you do like these types of videos, there's a whole playlist below called the Choose a Photo Playlist, and you can find more and more of these videos and go back and get all of your messages and predictions. And also, if you're new here, and really quickly, I'm Mary Kate, and I'm a mindset coach and manifesting expert focused on getting you transformational results. My whole channel is all about manifesting the law of attraction with meditations and more, where I share the tools you need to get the results you want. I post brand new videos every Wednesday, so be sure to subscribe and also hit that little bell notification so you can be notified whenever I post a new video. I share so many meditations, subliminals, law of attraction training, so much more. So definitely you wanna hit that bell notification. Now, like I've mentioned in some of my other videos, this is not tarot, it's not any kind of psychic thing. This is all actually based through psychology, energy, visualization, and interpretation. And also, like I mentioned, you will most likely be very shocked at how accurate this gets for you. Now, in just a moment, I'm gonna show you four of those photos up on the screen at the same time. And please, without overthinking it or going too deep or going back and forth or getting in your head about it, you are going to choose just one so I can give you your message and prediction and your symbol, affirmation, and meditation. Just pick one, let it be really intuitive and trust yourself. It's not about whatever picture you like, it's about what you are drawn towards. That's how you know you're gonna get the right message and all of the timestamps will be in the description. I always get asked that question. They're always in the description box. And feel free to come back to this video and review again in a week, in two weeks, in a month, and see if you get a new message. So let's get into it. Here are the four photos, and again, just pick one, and I will give you the message and prediction based on whichever photo you choose. Here they are, and you have just a few seconds. Okay, are you ready? Did you pick one? If not, go back, quickly pause this video and choose one, don't overthink it. And now let's get into the messages and predictions. So if you chose the first photo of that ladder leading up into the clouds, here is the message and prediction that you were meant to hear, as well as an affirmation and a meditation for you to use that will benefit you the most. Right now, you are in the process of manifesting something that feels big to you. Maybe it's a huge goal or a dream that you've been wanting for a really long time now. But at the same time, you feel sort of stuck because you have no idea where to even start to accomplish something this big, something that feels so different from what you've already had before. You might even be wondering, is this even possible for me? But if you are seeing this right now, this is your message and sign that you are meant to have whatever this big goal or dream is. Even though it might feel big right now and you have no idea how it's going to happen or unfold, it's a yes for you. But right now, it's important to know that there is action required on your part right now. You have to start embodying it now, even before it's here. And you need to start working on building the ladder of your beliefs within your subconscious programming. The ladder of core beliefs that will lead you to this big goal or dream. So here is how you're going to do it. Instead of trying to start from where you are right now and already be at the end result as far as believability, you are going to build it gradually as you go. 
So let yourself be where you are right now. Start with where you are right now. And this first rung of the ladder is going to be playing around with the belief that I fully believe this is possible for me. And then once that belief feels natural and believable, you're going to choose the next belief that feels a little bigger. And then when you normalize that new bigger belief, you then choose a new one that feels bigger and so on and so on. You are building your ladder of beliefs a little bigger each time to get from where you are now in terms of how possible and how real this feels to you all the way to becoming fully certain without a doubt that it's inevitable, which is where you wanna be at the end result. So it's one step at a time. And when you form these new beliefs, the best part is, is that your entire reality will start reflecting back to you these new beliefs. It creates this whole kind of effect over everything in your life. So all of the right people, places, circumstances, situations, everything starts lining up for you in the best way for you to have this end result. It's so easy to get caught up in the end result, thinking that we need to find the solution. We need to find the way to make it happen. But truly switching out and deciding to build new beliefs is what creates the right circumstances for it to happen. Because as you build these new beliefs, everything in your life starts to kind of line up and reflect that. So get excited, it's yours, and start building this ladder of beliefs until you are so certain that you wouldn't even question it. That's how you know you've done your part. And if you chose this photo, I want you to play around with the affirmation, it's all possible, my success is inevitable. And if you chose this photo, start using the law of assumption meditation or the manifesting portal meditation. Either one is gonna help you start building those beliefs. So choose whichever one feels best or use them both. And if you chose this photo, your prediction is that you are going to start seeing feathers all over the place, on the ground, in pictures, on notebooks, books, billboards, you will start seeing feathers all over. And when you do, let it be a reminder to go bigger and to climb that ladder of beliefs, gradually, slowly building it up and up and up until you're at certainty. If you chose the second photo of that sphere with the clouds and the meadow in it, here is the message and prediction that you were meant to hear, as well as an affirmation and a meditation for you to use that will benefit you the most. If you chose this photo, this is your sign that you need to go beyond what you thought was initially possible. The things that you think you want, you can go even bigger, giving you permission right now. Because right now you are operating from just a small portion of what is actually possible for you. And you need to lean into the concept and idea of, or better. Sometimes it's easy to get lost on a fixation on something very specific that you want without realizing that something even better might actually be available. What if you were hyper-focused on manifesting a specific person, but there was actually a better option or even your soulmate? What if you were hyper-focused on manifesting $10,000, but then you missed out on receiving a hundred thousand because you were so hyper-focused on that 10,000? A lot of people tend to get caught up in getting specific when it comes to manifesting because maybe that's what someone told them to do or something a book said to do. But manifestation is not a one size fits all approach. I am here to clear it up for you and tell you that sometimes being general opens you up for more than you ever thought was possible. Leave a little room for magic and surprise. So decide the general idea or concept of what you want and more importantly, decide the feeling that having this thing would make you feel and then lean in to deciding this or better and watch how it unfolds. Don't get so caught up in the specifics. Allow it to unfold the way it unfolds. Operate from the belief that more than enough is available to you and that there are endless possibilities and resources. And when you start to open up your perspective like this, you will be amazed at how easily things start to fall into place for you. It's time to free yourself from your comfort zone and step into new levels of possibility. Raise your standards and everything will start to shift. And if you are seeing this photo, your prediction this week is that you are going to start seeing purple flowers. They could be on an actual plant. They could be in a photo, a commercial. Just wait and see how these start showing up for you. And let these purple flowers be a reminder to go bigger. Let it be your symbol and reminder that you are worthy of the best that life has to offer. So embody it. And if you chose this photo, you have two affirmations to choose from, or you can use both. The affirmations are, I am only available for my expectations to be exceeded 
or, and or, I am open and ready to receive what I desire or better. And if you chose this photo, be sure to listen to the affirmation meditation. I will leave a link up here and a link down below for that meditation for you. If you chose the third photo of that flowers leading into that jungle, here is the message and prediction that you are meant to hear, as well as an affirmation and a meditation that will benefit you the most. There is something that you have wanted to do or some move that you've wanted to make but you have been hesitating and questioning it, questioning if it's the next right step or the right decision over and over and over again. It's almost like you just keep going in circles and talking yourself out of it, even though there's a part of you deep down that knows what to do and wants to take action. This is your sign that it's time to give yourself permission to follow where you feel led to follow the right decision and action that feels right to you to take. This is your sign to trust yourself. The best way I can explain it is this. When you want to manifest something, there is a specific frequency that you need to match in order to have that thing. So let's think of it like a radio station. And let's say this thing that you want to manifest is at 102.7. And right now you're at 99.7. So you set the intention of getting to 102.7 and then your internal guidance system will get to work to lead you on the right path with all of the right steps to get there from where you are at 99.7. So by following where you feel led and taking the actions that feel right deep down for you, that puts you directly on that path to get to that frequency with the least resistance. Does that make sense? Your guidance system will give you the path to follow, but you have to actually trust yourself and follow that path. So when you're hesitating, making a move that feels right for you, you are simply just delaying and denying yourself to get on the path of least resistance to have exactly what you want. Get out of your own way. Sometimes you just need to take the steps or make the decision. And even though it might feel like you're stepping into the unknown, maybe not seeing the certain light at the end of the tunnel, sometimes you just need to trust yourself and the guidance system you have within. It doesn't always have to make logical sense, but it has to feel right for you. And even further, I encourage you to form the deep, deep core belief that everything always works out for you in the best way. This will eliminate fear in the future of making certain decisions because no matter what, you firmly believe that everything always works out for you. So even when things don't work out the way that you expect or maybe the way that you imagined, they always work out in your favor in the end, so it really doesn't matter. You are limitless and unstoppable. So if nothing was stopping you, what decision would you make? If you knew that it always worked out for you, what actions would you take? When you follow where you feel led and take action when you feel called to, you will put yourself on the direct path to receive what you want easily. So remember that. And if you chose this photo, play around with the affirmation, everything always works out for me in the best possible way. It's always being rearranged in my favor. And be sure to start using the manifestation subliminal or the higher self-guided meditation. And your prediction is that you will start seeing jungle animals everywhere. I'm telling you, people laugh when I share these predictions, but just wait and see. Watch how many jungle animals you start seeing lions, tigers, monkeys, reptiles, you'll see. And don't worry, I don't mean they're gonna be like in your living room, I hope not. But they could be on a sign, a billboard, a commercial, a picture. Just watch how they show up for you. Be open to receiving that symbol. And if you chose the fourth photo of the Northern Lights over the mountain, here is the message and prediction that you were meant to hear, as well as an affirmation and a meditation for you to use that will benefit you the most. If you chose this photo, this is your sign that some major miracles are about to happen for you. So get ready and get excited because something even greater than you thought possible is right around the corner. You may have gone through a bit of chaos recently or had some major changes in your life, but it's all uphill from here. There is some amazing and powerful energetic momentum happening for you. So start to enjoy the process and be on the lookout for miracles all around you. There are so many opportunities available to you. So right now is a great time to start getting clear on what you wanna create and build within your life. Start to set new standards around what you desire financially, romantically. Start laying out your goals and dreams because everything energetically is on your side right now and wants to conspire with you to bring forth exactly what you want. If you chose this photo, your prediction is that you are going to start seeing snowflakes. 
and it's June right now, so most of us in the world are approaching summer. So I'm not saying these snowflakes have to be physically seen in person falling from the sky. Oh, the landscapers are here. If you know this, they always show up when I'm filming. <laughs> but you could see snowflakes in a picture or a song about snowflakes or see something in a movie. Just watch how they show up. Snowflakes are your symbol, you'll see. And when you see them, let it be a reminder that just like the Northern Lights, some things are just inexplicably magical. Let it be your sign that magic is happening for you right now and miracles are on their way to you because they are. And if you chose this photo, be sure to start listening to either the magnet meditation or the new miracle subliminal. I'll leave both links down below for you so you can play around and see which one fits best or you can use both. And also if you chose this photo, be sure to start playing around with the affirmation, I am open and ready for magic and miracles. So those are the four photos. Let me know which photo you chose, if it was one, two, three, or four, and if the message resonated with you. I especially love hearing the results from these choose a photo videos, because like I said, they are insanely accurate. And also if you wanna watch the other videos in the choose a photo playlist, the link for that is down below. I really hope that you enjoyed this video, and if you did, be sure to subscribe and also hit the bell notification so you can get notified whenever I post a new video. You can also find me over on TikTok and Instagram at mkmagicmindset. And if you wanna learn more about me, my programs, how to work with me, and more, you can visit my website at mkmagicmindset.com, and I will see you in the next one.